welcome to the Granny Wolf episode. So before I get into this episode, this is me recording this in the future. This was from a stream that was a very long stream, but this is a segment of that stream. So I didn't do an intro um, for this. Basically, I had attempted to start a new save file during the stream and play as a random family. And honestly, doing that just like was not a vibe. I'm not even gonna upload it to YouTube because it's not even worth the time to edit it. Um, Cause it just like wasn't fun, honestly. So that being said, I was like, you know what? Forget this lame ass save file. Let me go back to my actual save file and let's find Granny Wolf a new house. So that's exactly what I did. I um, found Granny Wolf a new house. We plopped it down. And then after that, you'll see the rest of the live in here. Um, so it's gonna be kind of an abrupt start with me just already talking and in the midst of things. But as I was saying, I had already been streaming other things um, prior to this. That's why I'm kind of just like already in the thick of it talking. But yeah, now you're caught up. Enjoy. Let's go ahead and play at her new house. Um, so this looks like it's gonna be Schmurderina's room over here. So let me make this more Schmurderina room like. I'm gonna tap G so those lines go away, the grid. Also this tree is in my way. Um, I do like all the rugs everywhere. Let's get rid of the bunk bed. Actually no, we'll keep the bunk bed up there. I know that she's just a little baby right now. So uh, because of that, I will give her a little toddler bed, but um, you know what, fuck it. I guess get rid of the bunk bed. I was gonna try to save it for later, but I'll just pop it back down later. Boop. Okay, we got our little toddler bed. Great, I'm gonna push that up against the wall. We need more baby shit. I guess she can get this little like, cat. Great. I think we should age up Schmurderian too. I feel like she's been a little baby baby for quite some time. So Granny, go ahead and make the babies a little uh, birthday cake, shall we? Where the fuck is our stove? Oh, in here. I don't know how I feel. Oh, we don't have counters. Um. Wow, what a sim. Lord Farquaad just stopped what they were thinking about for a moment. Found themselves staring at Granny Wolf. Oh. Oh, that's so cute. Found himself staring at Granny Wolf. Wow, how romantical. How freaking romantical. Um, hello. There we go. So grossly adorable, right? Um, come in here. We need to go ahead and cook. And we are going to make... Ooh, matcha tea cake. I just learned how to make my own matcha at home. Oh my god, life changer. Let's go make a chocolate cake for the baby's birthday. I'm excited for little Schmurderina to age up. She's apparently cold. Look at that granny baby. She's so granny coated. She's so granny coated. And you know Lord Farquaad ain't ever, ain't ever gonna leave granny. He'd be terrified. He'd be freaking terrified. How does Doris and Farkley feel about Farquaad and granny? I'm gonna be honest, I don't think Doris or Farkley really gives a fuck, to be honest. Thank you, Court, for the fruit friends. Um, I think Doris just wants Granny to, you know, behave. And I think Farkley just really does not care. Oh, gee, little grandma. Yeah, thank you, Piss McGee, for the fruit friends. Um, I know Granny keep him too busy for anyone else, right? Can we get a Granny Farquaad wedding? That would be fucking hilarious if we do a wedding in the future. Maybe we'll have to do a wedding at some point. Here comes the cake. Let's go ahead and... Hello. Um, excuse the fuck out of me. Can I click on this fucking cake? Bitch, why can't I... Um... Hello? Please have her dip him up uh, in the wedding and kiss. Oh my god. White jumpsuit. Get fed by gr Oh, I was clicking as a baby. That's why. That's why. Uh, let's add the birthday candles. Because you were the baby. I just saw it afterwards. Sorry. 
my dumbass. We have the birthday cake right here. Let's um help blow out candles. Wait, I think Schroeder is already being held by Farquaad, so let's get him to help her blow out the candles. Help blow out candles. Schmurderina, it's your birthday. Granny, get down here. You're about to miss it. Oh my god, Granny, you're missing it. Schmurderina's blowing out her candles. <laughs> Thank you, Martina, for following. Not the aggressive clicking. Um, her new trait is fussy. Great. Look at little Schmurderina! Oh my god, so cute. Granny's got a damn headache. She has got a damn headache. Okay, let's bring her into Create a Sim so we can pick out her little outfit. Can they have another name, Franny? Should they have a second baby? That would be really cute. That would be really cute if they got pregnant with a second baby. Here is baby Schmurderina. I freaking love her to pieces. Um, actually, no, let's try and make her look a little bit more like little granny. Make her look like a little granny lady. Oh, Gina, way too cute. See you on YouTube. Okay, see you on YouTube. Uh, love you, good night. Our little granny girl. Um, boop, boop, boop. why? We we'll give her some little leggings. Uh, two cutie patootie. Um, give her bright colors to find her outside. Let's do her sleepwear. Um, this is for sleep. The tennis shoes for sleep. We'll just do this. That's really cute. The hot weather wear. We'll do. Let's see. Oh, this is adorable. So cute. I love little Schmurderina. And then there's that. Little glasses. Oh my god, we should do little glasses. Um, there isn't a lot of options, but. Because those are more like sunglasses. You do these little glasses. So freaking cute. Let's see if we can try to maybe get uh, Granny Wolf and Lord Farquaad pregnant again. I feel like Schmurderia is going to be my fave on her season. I don't know. We'll see. I'm excited for little uh, Reapley. For sure. Um, so could y'all perhaps try for another baby? Would that be... Wait, why can't y'all... Oh, she's asleep. Granny, where are you? No, get up here. Let's go try for a baby with Lord Farquaad. About to make Schmurdery know. I didn't realize there was a bunk bed down here. I didn't even realize this whole thing was down here. Wow. Cute. Very cute. They have to have a science baby. No, Lord Farquaad will carry the baby. It'll be fine. Um, hello. We're trying to have a baby with you. Physical intimacy. Try for a baby. I hope you're ready to uh, lube your butthole again because um, that's what's coming for you, Lord Farquaad. That's what's coming. Mm. She's feeling a little tired, too. You can pass out after this. I actually really like that bed. That's really cute. Schmarterina, you okay, girl? Oh, she's going to go eat her cake. Or she is eating her cake on the couch. Cute little baby. I dream of a baby Franny for this mob family. I think it would be cute if they had another girl. This means uh, Farkley is about to get another sibling. I've missed so much tonight. You really have it. It was a lot of just bullshitting around for the first, like, few hours. <laughs> it wasn't, like, anything too serious going on, I promise. Now, the most eventful thing is Granny Wolf and Lord Farquaad probably having another baby. Another girl or twins. We're about to find out. 
Lord Farquaad, it's time to take a pregnancy test. Pregnancy test. Oh, we can go upstairs too. Interesting. Um, where is the potty? Oh, it's in here. Let's go take a pregnancy test. Franny and felony. <laughs> I love the bullshitting. Me too. I'm just enjoying my Friday night with y'all. Whose house? We just got this house for Granny and Farquaad. It's like a wolf house. So cute. Are you pregs? Are you pregnant? Are you with baby? Eating for two! Oh my Atlanta. Well, hold on. Let's put him into labor real quick. Boop, 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 beep. I guess I'm the problem. Cause you don't ever do no wrong. Um. Oh, I saw it. I'm changing that. I am changing it. It was supposed to be a boy. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. I just changed it to a girl. <laughs> Cause no, we're not having a freaking boy. Are you joking? Um, yeah. Let's go first. Let's put the birth and pillows in the bed so that he can poop this thing out. Birthing pillows. Okay, pillows. Our God is an awesome God. Pillow. Here's our birthing pillow. They need some more money. Shit, they're about to run out of money. Um, we'll do it. I think the pillows actually have to be like right there. Um, Farkilla? Uh, let's go. Oh, not fully dilated. I can fix that too. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Um, give birth immediately. Granny, don't go to sleep now, girl. We gotta have this baby. Girl, wake up. We gotta have the baby. I'll fix y'all's needs. I guess I'm on the problem. Cause you don't ever do no wrong. That song is stuck in my head. Alright, Lord Farquaad, you've got this. You've got this. Oh! Not the bathing suits for the birth! Oh, Lord. Granny's about to yank that thing out. Don't you worry, honey. Granny's gonna get it out. Granny got it in there, she'll get it back out. Not the forehead kisses from Granny! Oh, I'm trying to get in here. Not him be like, oh, ha, ha, ha. Oh, he's on all four. Oh, not the Granny butt in the way. Just poop her out. It's okay. You can handle this. You are made to handle hard things. Just poop it right on out. Oh, it fell out the front. It's a girl! The bonnet. Glasses match is such a sleigh. Is that Granny Wolf? Uh, yes. Yes. Yes, it is. Haven't watched it in a while. Oh, it's okay. It's just chaos all the time. You're good to just pop in when you want. Uh, Franny for a name. I like the name Franny. Franny and Schmurterina. Franny Farquaad, that's such a cute name. Look at Granny pulling it out. We have a baby. Thank you, Simone, for the fruit friends. Oh my goodness. The little kiss. So freaking cute. I wish we could see the darn baby if it would stop blurring everything out now. Um, why do I feel like I just saw Granny's boob? Well, maybe I didn't. Maybe that was just her bathing suit. I want to see the baby as an infant, so I am going to age it up just one time. Just one time is all I'm going to do for aging it up. Um, because obviously the newborns just look like that. Like, I appreciate the newborn look, but I want to see it as an infant. Um, that's my mom's name, Franny. This is an intense baby. Oh my gosh, she got the granny hair too! Bring this baby into create a sim. Maybe she'll have dark hair. Nah. All the gray hair. Let's make a cute little wolf nursery. Oh. Uh. 
What? Not Lord Farquaad. Girl! Um, hello? These babies look like Granny. 1,000% look like Granny. Um, I'm gonna give her the same hair that her sister had, that Schmurderina had. And then we're gonna make her look a little old lady-ish. Um, not old lady, but you know, how Granny would dress her baby. Um, so freaking cute. I guess I'm the problem. That song, oh my god, get it out of my head. Um, ew, maybe this little bee one. I'm a bee, I'm a bee, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a bee. Was Farquaad even involved? Uh, Farquaad had to shit it out, so. But, other than that, like, his face, no. And you know what's crazy is? This all started with a breed out the Farquaad challenge. All we needed was Granny. Because Granny's genes are the ones taking over here. I mean, look at Schmurt Arena. Look at freaking Franny. Sweet babe. <laughs> Franny will be a force to reckon with. Um, that's her formal wear and stuff. Her sleepwear. Let's get... Is there a little baby bonnet with... Oh! I gotta add a bonnet to her sister, too. So freaking cute! So cutie patootie. Stop it! That's so freaking cutie patootie! Um, her hot weather wear. Let's put her in this. Winter wear. Let's make sure she's all bundled up. Um, her sister needs her nighttime bonnet. Can we get a peek at adult? I'm gonna keep their adult selves a secret for now. Um... Oh, that's cute as shit. I love them so much. Stop. No, why is Granny's family really coming along? Really coming along. Thank you, Spence. Thank you, Pips McGee, for the fruit friends. Oh, my goodness. So freaking cute. No, Granny. D Wait. Franny is a werewolf. But Schmurderina is not. But I think Schmurderina could become one as an adult, but she's a dormant wolf. Um, 39th in gaming, OMG. <laughs> Thank you, Andy. Um, but Franny is a wolf. Oh my god, that's her twin. That's Granny's twin right here. Baby Franny. Those are all the kids that they need, too. Having the two girls, the two baby wolf, an intense werewolf. No, literally. I thought Schmarterina was a wolf. I think she's like a dormant wolf is what it said, but I'll have to check here a second. But it says Franny is like a wolf, like for real. You need a wolf pack. Oh my God, could you imagine a whole wolf pack full of Granny and Farquaad children? So what it says about Schmarterina is, um, let me put her needs up. Mm. It says dormant wolf. This wolf sleeps soundly within Schmurderina. What would it take to awaken? So she could become a werewolf later on if the wolf inside of her were to awaken, but she's a dormant wolf right now. Her little sister, Franny, is a werewolf. Like, straight up is a werewolf. Interesting. Um, Farquaad is in for it whenever they're in teens. Uh, can you say hi, Carson? Hey, Carson. Uh, a whole litter. OG, I made it live. I'm so glad you're here. I just did 5.5k likes. Oh my freaking god. Can we make that library a little nursery? I agree. We do need, like, a little, a little nursery area for the baby. Um, oh, fuck. Um, yeah, that's fine. I'm not gonna change too much about this room, but the infant beds, don't they have to sleep in a crib still as an infant? So, let's do... I guess I'm the problem. You don't ever do no wrong. <laughs> and then on the other side, we'll do... 
a little changing table, I suppose. That is not very roomy. Fuck the changing table. Instead of that, let's just do a tiny little baby but No, that looks ugly as fuck. Guess I'm the problem. You don't ever do the wrong. <laughs> Okay, and then this corner, I'm going to put in some, this little wolf toy. Actually, one size smaller. Thank you, Simone, for the fruit friends! Also, sorry, I keep hum humming the song. It's literally fucking just, like, stuck in my head uh my deepest apologies if it's annoying the shit out of you it's annoying the shit out of me i don't usually build on lives because um i feel like people make fun of me but here i am <laughs> doing this little build moment on a live Uh, it's stuck in my head now. I'm so sorry. Oh, thank you guys for achieving the live goal. I think that was the 15th live goal of the night met. Um, thank you guys so much. I'm gonna look at the competition thing really quick. Um, we met our 10 hours, by the way. Um, and I'm at 2.23 million. Justin is at 1.72 million. Um, anyway. Oh, where was I at? Okay. Um, is there any other toys that I want to put in here? Um, maybe... No, we already have that one bear. Let me do a little horse instead. Yeah, I like that little, that little pile of toys she has going on. So it's not like the cutest little, like, nursery ever or anything, but I think it's good, um, for now. Uh, you're so brave doing uncomfortable things on live. Thank you. I mean, at some point, I just have to, like, get used to it, I guess. Um, just like my face. I used to not show my face, and now here I am. Um, 1.2, yay. 1.2 million likes. Craziness. Okay, pick up this baby. And try to go night-night. Oh, my God, yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, she's trying to go night-night herself. No, no, no. Why don't you come put Franny to bed? Let me change her needs to where she's just like tired um, and all her other needs are good. I'm gonna be honest, I hate dealing with the children in the games, <laughs> but it's fine. What's your favorite place to eat at? Honestly, I really love going to a Mexican restaurant, like no specific re Mexican restaurant, but I love different Mexican restaurants. Um. I'm not a big Italian person, mainly because pasta fucks my stomach up. Um, yeah, usually like Mexican places are my favorite to eat. We need a house tour. It looks like basically what it is for this house is, it's kind of dark in here now. There we go. The little living, this looks chill as fuck. This whole house looks like chill as fuck. I don't know how I feel about the cauldron for granny up here, but whatever, maybe she'll start getting into that. Um, the vibes are very cozy in here. The kitchen is a little tight, not gonna lie. Also, it looks like there were some cabinets here that aren't here now, so we'll probably have to add some of those in later. Um, and then their little bedroom, bathroom, and then they have two bedrooms for their two daughters, which is perfect. We'll have to think on if we want to, um, make them have more, uh, children in the future. Do we need to assign beds and a quick house for food, please? Uh, I don't think we'll need to assign the beds just because right now the beds are literally the only ones that their ages can fit in. So it should be good. More a litter, <laughs> a literal litter. Um, I have to pack my stuff for tomorrow and it's almost midnight. Um, so I think I'm going to be ending 
be live here. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this like long, chill, but kind of weird live. I love you guys. Good night.